So I just got the 65 Ford truck. I'm going to put the body and shorten the bed and this and that and breathe a little new life into my Bronco, which is right here. It's a little bit too beat up, I think, for street driving. That and the body is literally falling apart. Doors won't open and close. Can't put a windshield in it because it's been rolled too many times. Uh, it's been sitting right here in the dirt with the axle broken in half for the past year or year and a half. So we've already started, we got the axle back in, did a little quickie weld on the on the radius arm to hold it temporarily. And we're about ready to fire it up and see if it runs. Here's Andrew's Bronco, which is basically a clone of what mine used to be. Start up the Bronco after a year and a half. Let's see what happens. Oh you gotta put the battery cable on. Oh yeah. Year and a half battery cable. Yeah, watch out for the leaves. Whoa, pump it. Pump it like 10 or 15 times. Pump it. I don't think there's gas pumps up there yet. I know, but pumping it, it lets the air bleed through it. That's not bad, year and a half. Exhaust leak and all. Shut the hood, Jeremy. All right, it'll shut on its own. I don't think anything's in the way, so you can just drive it right up on the rack. No, drive it. It'll drive. It, you can drive forward. Just no brakes. Just wherever you go, wherever you go. Sounds good. The forward bands are posted. So you have to drive it over there in reverse, I guess. <laughs> Go, push him, push. It was high. Okay, kill it. You gonna take the damn door off? Okay, now back up. Now straighten it up. Right, straight up. Perfect, perfect, perfect. A little bit more, a little bit more. Right there, good. Okay, go, go. okay, this is a suspension travel test. We're gonna see how much down droop we have in the suspension. Go ahead. Oh wow, it's looking really good. That's, good. that's, that's a good like three feet or so there, I think. Excellent. Got the willies back there. We're gonna winch the body off. We got it 
chopped off. We cut the cage everywhere. Cut the front end off. What? Should be ready to fall off. Here we go, body winching. Oh, that didn't work. And here we go again. Winch the body off. I know. Well, we're making progress. It turned out the exhaust brackets were going to the body. Bent the uh, the bar where we have the winch hooked on slightly. Stop! 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 And we have a problem. That problem. We have a problem! What? We ruined the frame. What? Oh my god! Now that we got it disconnected from the bent frame. I guess it didn't quite clear.